can't wait to get on the road. Welcome back to All Roads Lead to Rody. Baseball season's right around the corner. And what better way to kick off the season than a brand new look to the field. And I found out Coach Serato was the reason behind the renovations after he contacted some URI alumni and other supporting donors to give the field a little more pizzazz to it. When Coach uh, Serato got hired, one of the things he wanted to do was make sure we had a better fan experience. So he worked with some alums and uh, some donors to put together what I think is a pretty unique setup for our baseball field now where you can go and, and, and be able to watch the game comfortably. Uh, and it also has a pretty cool aesthetic look to it as well. So it's just the beginning. I mean, we want to do a lot more around baseball. And we, again, because we've had success, it's a program that we believe can win the A-10 championship every year. Um, we want to keep growing it. We needed to really upgrade um, just for the for the fans, for some place to seat, uh, to sit, uh, you know, just a, a, a nice looking facility when you walk in. So it's been uh, high on the agenda for, for a few years. With the renovations now in place, the team has seen an improvement in fan support. With the spike in attendance, players have seen a new home field advantage that may have been missing in recent years. I asked players Kevin Heiss and Mike Foley what the upgrades from Serato meant to them. It means a lot to have Coach Serato care about uh, the fans' experience because it helps us in the field. I think last year we had a 15-3 and record, and last year was really the first year we had a lot of fans start to come. 15-3 and at home. 15, that's what I meant, 15-3 at home. And uh, so we had a bit of a home field advantage. We had, you know, like hundreds of fans in some games. And yeah. I know my parents come up more to better experience here. A lot of local parents come, and now we get some more students coming too. Yeah, it's definitely nice. This is this is actually like the best way to sit on this berm is what Coach Rado was saying, is leaning up against the berm. And it's, um, it's a lot nicer to have this atmosphere. Um, we want to continue to do another seating berm on the third base side. Our next plans are a batter's eye in center field because uh, it's a tough background for the hitters to see and then a uh, new press box with a room for uh, a suite for the uh, for alumni or fans, a uh, radio room or TV room, um, a, and then chair back seats behind home plate eventually, maybe two or three hundred chair back seats. So there's a lot of plans for us and uh, over the next few years, so we're hoping to uh, really up, continue to upgrade this over the next five to ten years. It looks like positive changes are being made all around Rhodey Baseball. And we can't wait to see what's in store for this upcoming season. For more on the baseball team, check out our YouTube channel and our Facebook page on a feature on Tyler Wilson, the pitcher for the URI baseball team.